Franga, Frangapani. Look at me. It made me dance. Frangapani. Frangapani. Y'all keep them coming. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Ew. Listen, I'm not the one to be like, oh, it's become so mainstream. I'm not going to wear it. God forbid. I'm going to wear what I want to wear because on me, it's going to have its own flair. Spray your fragrances heavy. Okay. We're not going to take these fragrances into our casket. Okay. Let's spray them now. Let's enjoy them now. What up, it's your girl, Minna. In this video, we are gonna be going over a few of my newest fragrances. Now, obviously we are in a different area. I'm back in the studio. I just wanted something new, something different, and I'm standing. So I have more flexibility to move around. And, 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 and. I just need something different, you know what I'm saying? So if you're liking this new switch up change, let me know. We are also only using natural lighting. I do not have any LED lights on. I have the light in the back, but that's not lighting my face, mm -hmm. you know? And this look right here is my soft glam look. I'll link a video to that below in case you're wondering what does she have on her face? That'll be there. But let's get into what I've got so far because these are some good ones. All right, first up is this one that was actually sent to me in PR. I love Ellis Brooklyn. I did not know who they were or what they were about, but they continue to send me PR. And I've also purchased new fragrances from them on my own during the sale, which I'm looking forward to the 5th of November. You have to mark that down if you're Rouge. That's our day, honey. Come and let me know if you plan on shopping this for us, because I know I am. Like, hey, I'm ready, two months early. Ellis Brooklyn Vanilla Milk. Eau de Parfum. Now, let me pull up the information because that's always a necessity, you know? If you're not already, follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and also Pinterest, okay? This is 1.7 fluid ounce. This is a warm and spicy, warm and sweet gourmand. I love that. I'm ready. I have not smelled it. I'm already excited. This has bourbon, vanilla bean extract, upcycled cocoa shell, frangapa frangapani. Look at me. It made me dance. Frangapani. Frangapani. Oh, okay. Okay, good. I have not smelled this. This is $105. Okay. I'm excited about this. I love warm and sweet gourmands. Excuse me. Wowzers. Hi. Where are we today? Oh, okay. It needed, to, it needed to dry down. It was too harsh at first. Okay. Hold on. I like it. It smells like milk. <laughs> Vanilla milk is the name. It does smell like milk. It's also giving not so much coffee because there's there aren't nuts in this. But I, yeah, it does smell like vanilla bean extract. A little bit of chocolate, the co cocoa. What is frangapani? Frangapani? I cannot pronounce that, Avi. Yeah, I have to keep on smelling it. I do like it. It is a warm and sweet gourmand. It is giving me hot cocoa, but not so much chocolate, more of the milk for sure. Frothy milk, it's giving latte cappuccino is making me do this <laughs> if only you can see the wine your we is going on seriously i feel like you would smell this if you're close to me i don't know if this would project but i do like it i'm loving it is it's giving s'mores cozy socks cuddle vibes this is good okay okay it had to grow on me it had to grow on me wow ellis brooklyn listen y'all keep them coming keep them coming keep them coming Ew. now this one has a story so i had gone into sephora and i was going to exchange something and i saw that victor and rolf had a new fragrance and i can't lie sometimes i'm like oh the bottle looks like whatever i don't want it girl the bottle is not why we're here okay so I sprayed a little bit on my hand. It was fine. I walked away. We had gone to Trader Joe's and as I was reaching to look at things, I kept saying, what is that scent? What is that scent? Because it wasn't my original scent. And I felt what I had on that day. And I'm like, what is that? I kept thinking, do they have a, an air freshener in here? What is going on Trader Joe's? Why does this place smell so good? And then all of a sudden I said, let me smell my hand and lo and behold, it was this fragrance. I was like, bet. I had a Sephora at Kohl's gift card. I bought it. I was like, no. And you know, I liked it so much that I got the big size. So this is a three ounce bottle. It's $168. This is a warm floral. I love warm everything. Warm floral. It has fennel genshin. Fennel genshin. 
what? Flower extract, jasmine super infusion, and bourbon vanilla. Hi. So let's get a reminder of how fabulous this is because I don't remember and I did not spray any of these. I wanted to show my raw reaction. I love the sprayer. It comes out in full force. The other one was a little spritzy. This one was very, ooh, yes, I can smell it already. I can smell it already. Oh yes. Oh, I'm so glad I got this. Yes, off rip, I like this. Yes, wow, wow, wow. I like jasmine, I'm, I'm noticing. I'm feeling the creaminess, right? Cause it says that it's in, okay, so this floral perfume for women awakens a bright and aromatic note magnified by luxurious jasmine at its center and infused with creamy, captivating bourbon vanilla at its base. God almighty, this is great. If you have smelled this or plan on getting this, you have to comment and let me know. This is so good. Ooh. Next one. Now, Gucci Flora, I sprayed in the store and smelled because it's new and I was like, I wanna know if I need this because I have the gorgeous gardenia and this is gorgeous jasmine. I love jasmine, I'm noticing. <laughs> I love Jasmine, you know? So let's pull up this information before we spray. This is the 3.3 fluid ounce. It's $149. It's an eau de parfum. It is a classic floral, okay? It's got mandarin essence, grantiflorum jasmine, <laughs> and sandalwood. I love a good sandalwood, honey. Okay, let's give her, oh yes, oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. Something about it is giving me Chanel. It is a classic floral. Yes, yes. It's got a freshness to it. Yes. You can tell right away the difference between a warm floral and a classic floral. This is giving me just showered, fresh, maybe even beach, bright sun, not beach so much, but what I mean is bright sunny day. It's not giving me evening cozied up with marshmallows and fuzzy socks. It's definitely giving bright, classic floral. This is really good too. I like this. It's soft, it's elegant, it's sexy. This is good. I know I liked it. I smelled it in the store that day and I liked it a lot. Now, how cute is this bottle. Okay, Marc Jacobs, Oh So Fresh. I had seen this launch on IG and I thought, oh, I love my other, this is a bottle fragrance for me. This is a, I need the bottle kind of fragrance, but also really good. I do love Marc Jacobs Perfect. We discussed that last year and it was still so good to me. Ooh, I love the sprayer, nice and powerful. Here we go. Man, I forgot to pull everything up before I sprayed it. I've never smelled this before. Hold on, I wanna know what I'm gonna smell before I smell it. It's an eau de parfum. This is the 2.5 ounce, or is this the one ounce? This is the one ounce, I believe, and it's $82. This is a fruity floral. It has mango, rose water, cashmere woods. I was trying not to let it get into my nose. Okay, now let's smell it. Mango, rose water, cashmere woods. Oh, yeah, okay, it's giving mango, fun, fresh, flirty, youthful, young, great for, ch not children, but you know, teenagers. It's giving Snapple. It's giving Snapple. Oh yes, mango Snapple. This smells like mango Snapple, yeah. It's not for me. I'm into the more sophisticated, grown and sexy fragrances. I'm glad I got this in a small bottle because I wasn't so sure about it. I do like it, I don't love it. It's just, I have to make a differentiation because I have so many fragrances. So I like this, I don't love it. I can see myself giving this away. I don't know if it's the woods, the cashmere woods that's throwing off the mango. Cause when I think of a fruity scent, I'm thinking of Kaali Good Apple. And that is just straight fruit, Burberry Her, straight fruit in my opinion. And this, I don't know if it's the woods, something is throwing it off. Okay, let's try another one. <laughs> Okay, first of all, I also love Kaali Burning Cherry. That is so freaking good. I've been spraying that almost every day since I got it in PR. I was gonna buy it. Oh my goodness. Cherry with firewood, just amazing, great combination for the winter time. Gives you cozy, sweet, sensual. But I'm doing a lot right now. I am doing a lot because that's how much I love it. I'm gonna link that below too. It is so good. 
lid. I have the, what, medium size. I don't know the actual fluid ounces. I'm going to buy the bigger one. It is just that good. I am killing it. Those bottles, you can't tell how much you have left on those bottles. So I don't know how much I have left. I've been spraying very heavy. Spray your fragrances heavy, okay? We're not gonna take these fragrances into our casket, okay? Let's spray them now. Let's enjoy them now. And then two others that I've been loving from Zara. We've talked about this before in a different video I introduced to you, which I mean, me, I'm sure you've heard of these. I hope you've heard of these already. Cause I almost didn't say anything. So I'm thinking this has been all around social. They've heard of this. Well, apparently some of y'all haven't. Okay. I don't know where y'all at, but here I am. Okay. To worship and to tell you about these fragrances. We talked about Rose Gourmand and this being a dupe for MFK Gentle Fluidity Gold and how fantastic it is. I have like four of these, okay? That's how fantastic it is. They're so cheap, girl, please. I'm gonna link these below too. Stock up, okay? We don't know how long Zara gonna give us these fragrances. We can't trust them, okay? We wanna make sure we have a stash. If you love it, get extra. And then this is Red Temptation, Baccarat Rouge Dupe, MFK Baccarat Rouge 540. I love it. Listen, I'm not the one to be like, oh, it's become so mainstream. I'm not going to wear it. God forbid, I'm gonna wear what I wanna wear because on me, it's gonna have its own flair. Ooh, that rhymed and that wasn't even prepared. Ah, listen. This video has taken a turn. Listen, all the videos take a turn. And honestly, if we don't turn, you know, I don't know that if we've done enough, it's got to take a turn. Otherwise to me, it's just boring. Okay. This is Red Temptation Eau de Parfum. I have maybe six of these. So freaking good. I spray this to go to the gym. I spray whatever I want to go to the gym. You feel me? Baccarat Rouge 540 dupe. If you want to save $300, then you purchase this one. Get the big version, get the small one. Very affordable. The big one's $25.90. It's giving very grown and sexy, perhaps unisex, but you can rock it as a woman and be like, yes, it's me. It's giving boss vibes. It's giving I'm in charge. You know, it's giving all of that. And if that's your vibe, this is great. The Rose Gourmand is softer, I would say. This Red Temptation is very in your face, talk to me nice, don't play with me type vibes. Both very, very good. So those are my newest fragrances. So many good gems. I literally be so confused every day. I be like, what should I wear today? What is today giving? Because I just have too many options, but I'm not upset. You understand. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hopefully you laughed. Give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, turn notifications on because that's important as well. Follow on Instagram, TikTok, and Pinterest. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.